Hello everyone, welcome to the another episode of free cat tutorial on my channel. This is your host, Lily Kurniawan, and today I'll show you how to use FreeCAD to model this bracket engine. This is the 3D model that I've made. And this is the reference to create this 3D model. Before we start this tutorial, you can see what the button that I press here. You can see that. And I put the link in the description to allow you to download this reference so you can use it. In this tutorial, I divide this bracket image into four sections. The first section is here. I call it um, this is base, base of this bracket. And the second part, the second section is here the horizontal cylinder. The third is this vertical cylinder, and the last is the rib. Okay, let's get start with creating a new file. Then select this part design menu and now we create the plan to create this pattern we start with the right plan after you create the plan select this polyline to draw the pattern Okay, the next to make this line straight, you can use this tool, okay, to make this horizontal and this tool to make this vertical. Okay, the next step we will dimensioning this pattern based on this reference. You can see this is 40 millimeter and 24 24 or you can dimension this line with 48 millimeter then 84 here and okay And the thickness of here is 16 millimeter. You can select this point and this point and dimension with 16 millimeter. 56 millimeter here, then 28 for this line, then you can see the distance between this point and this point is 24 millimeter. Select this point and this point and create 24 millimeter. Oops, I think this is mistake here. There's mistake here and select this point and this point and create. 16 millimeter okay I think it's good and close it then we will extrude the sketch using the pad here okay extrude with 
you can see here 16 plus 16 and plus 16 and you've got the 48 millimeter and select the symmetric to plan to apply length symmetrically to the sketch okay then click ok then you can see the radius here and here so I'll make a fillet here with five oh I think like this edge and create the fillet and I'll make fillet here with four millimeter because there is no radius dimension from this image and then make a fillet again here with eight of radius okay I think the first section is done then we will create the second section that is this horizontal cylinder and create a sketch start with the right plane again then you can use this tool to make the construction line, line then select this edge to convert the line then draw a cycle and bring it to the middle of this line select this point and this point and you can give 28 millimeter because this middle of this distance then dimensioning this circle with 56 millimeter select the constraint diameter and 56 millimeter then close it and extrude again select the symmetry to plane and dimensioning or extrude with 28 plus 16 and 28 you can get 20 uh, 72 millimeter okay and then we will create a hole here with 30 of the diameter you can select this space and create a sketch and convert it as the construction line so we got the center point of the sketch and then we'll create the cycle again and dimensioning it with 30 millimeter then close then you can select this tool to create a pocket with the select sketch okay create a pocket and you can select here up to face and click this face click, hold, click ok And next, 
I will make up space here. with creating a sketch on this face first select this face and create a sketch then convert this edge and this edge to be the construction line and next create the rectangle here then dimensioning this point this point you can see here 16 millimeter then this point and this point 16 millimeter again Then make the boundary of the cutting with 28 millimeter from this point and this point. Then select the pocket and Pocket it with fifty six millimeter and it's great. So the next step is we will create this vertical cylinder. Okay, select this face and create a new sketch. for this edge to be construction line and create a cycle here and dimensioning with dimensioning it with 32 millimeter of diameter okay and bring this point into middle of this line uh, dimension this point and this point of oops there's a mistake and uh, select this point to this point that you can see here the middle of this face is 24 millimeter 24 millimeter here then plus it and extra it again with 40 millimeter of height okay then we will create a hole here with 16 millimeter of diameter and 20 millimeter of deep okay select this face create a sketch and convert it to the construction line and so you get the center of the circle then start create cycle from this point and dimensioning it again with 16 millimeter and close it then create a pocket again with 20 millimeter of the oh you can see it here and the last section i'll create this rib okay um, i think we start from this face and create a skate then convert 
hit. Create a rectangle. Yep. Then make this rectangle symmetric with this line. Where you see, you can select this point, this point, and this line, and create it to be symmetrically. Okay. Then create a circle here. Then you need to. I need to convert this line to make reference of this dimension. So you can dimension this point into this point with 20 millimeter and ten millimeter of the thickness then you can create a trim for it and trim it and trim it and delete this line then you can see here we've got sketch next close it and extrude it and reverse can select up to face here then click OK and we will cut this body using oh we will cut this body by creating a new sketch here then convert this edge to be the construction line then create a polyline say like this point to this point and you got the triangle here then cross it and create a pocket then you can then okay i think we're done with this modeling um, I think I can make this even more beautiful by adding a fillet for this body and you can adding a fillet here with one millimeter of radius then for this oh I think can select this edge select this edge and make a one of radius then you can make a chamfer here one point 